We're going to shift gears now. Literally, we are shifting gears. The bicycle gear is a new safety <laughs> feature for bike riders who are concerned about their well-being and maybe their hair, too. More you know, that's It's yes. important. NBC's Michelle Kaczynski is in Sweden this morning with the women behind a product that is generating a lot of buzz. Michelle, good morning. Hi, good morning. We're here in... Whoa! Oh! Oh! <laughs> Okay, the bike accident we planned. The story is this new bike helmet. It is an airbag for your head, getting global attention right now, invented by two graduate students here. Missed that crash? Well, look at this one in slow motion. Bam! Instant helmet from a pouch around the dummy's neck. Other tests? Equally dramatic. Even in real life. An amazing thing is the hovding. It's, it's not very heavy at all. Dreamed up by Therese and Anna for their master's thesis in industrial design from their mutual hatred of the helmet. I don't want anything on my head. I don't want to, my hair to be destroyed. So you guys would bike out in your city without a helmet? Everyone yes. did. <laughs> Everyone did. True, no matter how you high-tech them furry, furry. or trick them out. The Gilligan. Many agree. In some places where mandatory helmet laws were enacted, ridership actually dropped. It took yeah. seven years to engineer the Hovding, but they've now sold thousands in Europe. Berlin, 26th of April. Anna even carries around with her their first letter from a rider who believes that actually, nylon airbag, ejected in a tenth of a second by a small helium canister, saved her life. If I hadn't worn my invisible helmet, I'd smashed my head on the concrete that was giving us goosebumps, of course. Mm -hmm. Inside are sensors, analyzing your movements 200 times a second to determine what is a real crash. Mm -hmm. So we had to simulate all known oh my gosh. bicycle accidents. We kept trying to trick it into deploying. No luck. It took a sort of quick neck spin. <laughs> Bam! Didn't hurt, but it's, it's tight around your neck. It's hard, like a, yeah, like a football or something. I feel a lot, I feel a lot safer now. <laughs> On a bike in traffic, this could be no joke. Very real safety. Okay. <laughs> I think I see a future Halloween costume in this. But the makers say the tests have proven it to be three to four times more shock absorbent than a regular helmet. It also covers more of your head and neck. And, of course, you don't have to wear anything on your head while you're riding your bike, thus protecting your fabulous hairstyle. Uh, the downside for now is it costs more than $500 one-time use. And so far, is not available in the U.S. It may be five hundred dollars, but Michelle, those images of you trying to trick the helmet, That's great. priceless, priceless. priceless. We're going to make a music video. Of that. Why did they say acres have helmet in? <laughs> Thank you so I, much. I, I walk away with only a broken leg. There you go. Good way of putting yourself into it. I love it. Good job.